So with the rhythm, as we kind of mentioned in the introductory video, we're really tying into what is sung. So the melody that's sung, as we kind of looked at in the chord video, that is exactly what you're playing in your right hand, is that melody. So as a piano player, it's really important that you, probably even more than with other songs, that you tune into and are very familiar with the sung melody, okay? Probably in your practice, it's worth singing, even if you're not a singer, as you're practicing, to be able to sing out the rhythm, getting those uh, lyrics and things internalized. It's going to be very helpful to you because that is what you're following. Now in the bridge, yes, it is instrumental, but practicing the rhythm through there as well, very, very critical, all right? You're matching it so closely, even with other instruments. But let's talk through this a little bit here. And so we talked about the left hand, you know, bass notes. Really, these are going to move at the beginning of the song in those verses on every measure. So every four beats, if we're counting one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two. And then that's just how the chords move until you get to the end of the verse, right? So it, it picks up the pace a little bit. You're, you're going now for two beats on the F and then the C. One, two, three, four, to the G, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, and it's the F to the C to the G, two, three, four. Okay, so that gives now a little bit of build into the chorus. So simple rhythms on the verses, all right? Going to that little C to C suspended pattern, and this happens at the end of verses. It happens in the instrumental, even though you're playing right hand uh, melody stuff. That is a little bit of a different pattern where you've got a C happening uh, right on beat one. And then your little C suspended, kind of a passing chord, little note that happens, the C sus is on beat four. Okay, and then back to the one uh, on the C is very quick uh, between those two chords. So. It's like this, one, two, three, four, C, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, okay? So that's C, sus, C, sus, C, sus, C, and then it's chorus, dun, dun, okay? So that's gonna be a, a reoccurring theme. Now in the chorus, let's talk about this as we play that melody, okay? So again, Going with the play along video, you're practicing, maybe singing along with that as well, but just recognizing our rhythm of that. Okay, so we're starting up on the C. So one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two. So that little kind of three, four, one, dun, 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 and that happens kind of as a consistent rhythmic pattern in the melody, okay? So three, four, one, two, 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 three, four, one. And that's even quicker, 16th notes in there, uh, eighth notes actually, but you're following that melodic movement of heal our land and so even with the bridge then if you're going to be picking up the right hand melody well it's going to follow that same kind of c to c suspended rhythm pattern that we had earlier in the song because what's going on behind the right hand melody is that c sus c sus and then an a minor two three four one two three four one two three four one and so on Okay, so that's gonna be your movement of right hand uh, along with kind of that pattern. One, two, three, four, 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 one. So you see how it just keeps going? Two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Okay, so a few missed notes in there, but the rhythm is really straightforward and it's just repeating 
one, two, three, four, one, two. You've got chords that happen on beat one, beat four, and that'll walk you all the way through the instrumental till you get back to that last chorus. So some really kind of intricate things for the rhythm to keep in mind, but if you stick to those patterns, and again, work the play along video several times over until you feel really confident with both the chording, the right hand, and the rhythm, you'll have this song down.